welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, welcome. My name is Kayla. And if you're a returning subscriber, thank you so much for tuning back in. So this was my first convention. I had an amazing time. I'll go ahead and insert some clips um, that I took. I didn't take a lot just because it was kind of in the moment type of thing. So I was going to vlog, but then decided that... Pff, it's kind of hard to vlog when you want to just take it all in and just experience everything right then and there instead of having a camera in your face or in everybody else's face. So I did get a few clips, so I'll insert those clips in of what I have. Um, it was an amazing experience. I'm also going to share uh, some of the items that I purchased from the trade show. I spent so much money <laughs> but i felt like i didn't really get a lot i think that i the items that i did get were kind of on the more expensive side so yeah or maybe i don't know i'll, I'll show i'll share it with you guys and i'll let y'all be the judge of that but like i said i just feel like i spent too much money because i am cheap so three hundred dollars or four hundred dollars or Five hundred is expensive to me, so so yeah, I spent more so on the five hundred range, and that included food um, as well as the items. Now I take that back. I don't know if that included food, but I spent quite a lot over five hundred, definitely. But um. I guess it was because it was my first experience and I'm like, oh yeah, I want this, I want this, I want that. <sighs> I wish I could have went back and like, girl, what you doing? What you doing? You got bills. You got bills. You do. When you go home, you got bills. Yeah, but it's all good. It's, it's going to come back to me. It's, it's, it's going to come back to me. <laughs> Alrighty, so let's go ahead and jump into this video so I can share with you all of the amazing things that I bought and also just some um, experience that I felt that I connected with and everything else. So let's go. So I roomed with three of my line sisters, one of them being my mother, <laughs> but she was my line sister that weekend. She was my line sister. I made that very clear. Like, look, we mother and daughter on you know every other every other day but today this weekend we are line sisters and deuce deuce i'm your mama <laughs> girl you doing you're my line sister this weekend uh, of course she didn't really you know agree to that but hey i was just putting that out there i'll go ahead and insert a clip because i told her that and she was just like um oh, i'm your mama i'm your mama we know, but like I said, this weekend, we line sisters, but she didn't get that. But anyways, I ended up rooming, rooming with three of my line sisters. Hi, sister. Hey, guys. So we are in Atlanta and at our 55th convention, national convention. I'm with my LSs. Say hey. 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 All week, it was laughter, just pure laughter and goofiness and just smiles and hugs and just loves just what i love to be around that was, it was just an amazing feeling so i believe when we first got there we checked into the hotel first let's talk about the traffic the traffic oh my god listen don't nobody in atlanta gotta worry about me moving to atlanta because what i can't do is the traffic okay I don't know how y'all do it, but I applaud y'all, okay, because that traffic is not for me. It's not, okay? So, yeah, the traffic was a little bit busy. Um, we first checked into our hotel. Um, it was super nice. Love the downstairs of the, um, the lobby. The lobby was super cute. They had like this background of like a waterfall. We are currently at the hotel and we're about to go check in and register. Hey y'all. Hey. <laughs> so yes, I love the hotel. Yes, I'm about to show y'all the waterfall. Oh, it, it waves. <laughs> Look 
Look at that. Hello. Look at the greenery wall. And then also they have like kind of a selfie wall. That's what I want to call it. I'm not sure if it's used for that, but it was like a, a greenery scene. It was very beautiful. Um, what else? That of course they had like happy hours. So like once you check in the hotel after five o'clock, they'll give you like a little appetizer or refreshments if you want to call it that with a drink. So we went straight to registration after we checked in. And it was in the George Congress Convention Center, I believe. It is a huge building. We did a lot of walking. <laughs> hey, y'all. Hey. We are at the convention center. We're about to register. <laughs> Where's the key to? At the top. At where? At the top. <laughs> yes. So yes, I probably lost about two pounds, three pounds, give or take, hopefully. Um, but yeah, it was a lot of walking and um, yeah, so we went to registration. Of course, I thought that I registered um, for in person, but I was virtual, which was fine. Uh, it was still an amazing experience. So. I registered as um, I was virtual, so I wasn't able to get a convention bag once I went to registration, but my mom did. So it was a super cute bag, and it had little goodies and items uh, to help you along the weekend, um, just like for safety measures and protocols. So after that, we did go meet up with my other line sister, my uh, 21. So we went to meet up with her, and she was with her mentor. And we went to this restaurant called Ten, I believe. It's right next to the Mercedes Superdome. Um, I think that's called, it's called a Superdome. Or am I getting it mixed up with the New Orleans Superdome? I don't know. But anyways, so yeah, it was right next to the Mercedes-Benz uh, Superdome. And I believe it was like a Falcons game that night. So it was a lot of traffic. It was heavy traffic. It was packed. So we went to the restaurant. The restaurant was super uh, cute. I had some... I think I had some wings, garlic parmesan wings. That's like my go-to for wings. Or did I take that? I take that back. They didn't have garlic parmesan. I think they only had like barbecue and I had some fries to go with mine. So, yeah, I think I did. And then my last sisters, they had like, one had a burger, another one had some shrimp. And then I think my mom had like some wings too because she had regular wings. But my food was good. I really liked it. And um, I would never forget, we, this was <laughs> just an amazing time. The, the person who was kind of like um, the valet service, they were amazing and they were hilarious. <laughs> they were hilarious. So shout out to them. Shout out to them. So after we left the restaurant, I believe we went back to the room because we were like tired. So we went back to the room, sat up and laughed and, you know, all that good stuff and talk. So Friday, so we got there Thursday. So the next day, Friday, I believe we, uh, public speaking event where all of the Divine Nine was there. So they were like just saying great things about our national president. It was just so amazing. Um, we also, my chapter one in the world, a world. My chapter won an award. <laughs> uh, it was the Joy in Our Sisterhood Award. So we were super geeked about that. And I believe we were trying to go out to dinner that night, but end up not going. So we were just pretty much walking around the convention center. And like I said, it was huge it was a huge convention center so it was just an amazing experience to just be a part of that they also had praise and worship right after that event and um i think we end up eating at like the hotel lobby i had some wings again i think that's just definitely like my go-to like i'm a wing type of person like you can never you can't get that wrong if 
if a restaurant get that wrong, then I don't know. I just, I don't know, but like you can never get that wrong. So that's just my, my go-to. So Saturday, um, it was a full day of just excitement and just everything was just amazing. Like I said, I bought a four day pass to the trade show. So full of vendors, like. <laughs> Thing that you can think of was there um, to like items to like jackets, line jackets. Um, you have your bomber jackets, you have blazers, t shirts, sweatshirts, shoes, cups, um, bracelet and charms, uh, bags, just everything you can think of as far as Noya, it was definitely there. And you were going to spend some, some money. You were going to spend some coins. Also, in the trade show, Coca-Cola was a sponsor. So they had like a Coca-Cola section set up in the middle of the trade show. So where you can come in and get drinks. So they had like the Simply Drinks and they had it timed. So the Simply Drinks, I believe, were like in the morning. So you had like your orange juice and then your raspberry Simply. Um, I think at like the evening, you would have the Sprite. So different type of Sprites. They had the tropical, the regular, and then they had the cranberry. And then I believe a few hours after that, which is like around 4 o'clock, you'll have your Smart Water. So they had like uh, Smart Water with green tea in it, which was really good. The regular smart water and i believe it was another flavor and then the last one was the coke so you have a regular coke or a coke zero with no sugar my sister and my last sister really love the coke zero with no sugar i didn't want that and i don't really i'm not a big fan of coke so i stuck to, uh, stuck to like sprite and then the simply juices and also water so yeah so that was great i also insert some clips from the trade show like i said it was a whole bunch of vendors there and there was a lot of people in there so like i said i got some good stuff so I and share it with you all right so another place me and my last sister visit was the frost frost bistro place and that is rashida's and kirk's spot it was super cute on the inside food was really good of course y'all already know what my go-to thing is when i go to a restaurant and i ain't never been Yes, I got some wings, some garlic parmesan wings, and they was, they was busting. They was good. So, I got that with some fries, and then I tried their strawberry margarita. Definitely recommend if you go there. Super duper good if you like a sweet with a kind of like tangy type of taste or like a punch. A great little pig. Some of my sisters did get the lamb chop. Um, those are really good because I tried it and she let me try it. Um, she also got the strawberry margarita. Another sister tried the fish. Um, I think it was the red snapper if I'm not mistaken. I don't even know if that's on their menu. If I'm making it up, it's a fish <laughs> other than salmon. Uh, some sisters got their tacos. Another sister got some wings. So, pretty much that's what they end up getting. I don't think anyone, like, tried, like, hamburgers or anything. We pretty much got finger foods other than um, those two big meals that I did mention. So, that was an amazing experience. Like I said, it was cute on the inside. It's, like, three sections. So, we had our little section to ourselves. Or, I think it was, like, another couple because they had, like, a two-seater right behind us. But, other than that, that was it was just us in there. They also have like a few booths when you are looking on the in outside and then in the front when you walk in they have like a little club section and then they also have a bar in there so it's a another section so it's a pretty big place um once you walk into there it's super cute so yeah shout out to uh, Rashida and Kurt at Frost Bistro we really loved it and we had an amazing time so the first item I got this is the convention bag. So if you register virtually, you didn't get a convention bag at registration. It was going to be mailed to you. So I don't know what's going to come in the mail for me. But I just got this just in case because I thought it was super cute. 
So this this ran me about $45. Okay, so this is perfect for when I'm going to like a meeting. Um, like just doing Delta business. I would rock this. It's super um, huge. Actually, I'm going to go ahead and take it out the wrapping and show you guys what the inside looks like. So this is the close-up. Okay. The back of it. And this is what the inside looks like. So like I said, it's pretty spacious. back in go to business i'll be in style all right so let's go ahead and move on to the next all right so my line sister made me do this because she bought one and i was like oh my god where did you get that like take me to it so this is by inspired by mona for the diversity in you and it's a planner and it is gorgeous Look at this. This is so cute. So, I believe the first day, the price of this ranged from about $30. But I did wait. So, I got mine for $20. Yeah, it's got a deal. I love a deal. Love a good deal. So, let me go ahead and open it for you guys so that you can see what it looks like on the inside. Just in case if you want to order. So it has like the important dates for next year. Oh, excuse me, Diva coming through. So it has like all of that that you can put in there. I'm super excited. Like this was definitely worth twenty dollars. It's super cute and it's huge. I love that. That way I can like actually see it and it's not small. Like I mean, you can see it if it's small, but like y'all know what I mean. Like when it's actually like big you can kind of like be more productive i don't know it's okay it's all right so yes i believe this is probably like what for february or is it still january i don't know i didn't really take a look into it but y'all do y'all see this this is beautiful she did that she did that yes mona you did that girl all right so i'll try to find if she has like a website or instagram i'll leave all that information in the description box down below so that y'all can like reach out and if you want to purchase you can purchase okay so next i have this uh license plate tag for the front of my car look at this details like i said it's, it's always the details for me love it this is gold and has like the um red and then silver also, it has the fortitude, if y'all can see that, but this is fire. Yes, yeah, so when I saw this, I was like, oh, yes, I'm getting that. Pay $22 for it, um, and my line sister ended up getting the same one. So, we twinning, we twinning. Uh, so, yeah, this is super cute. Had to grab it. Couldn't let it pass me up. So, yeah. This is the one I got. Alrighty, so next I have a baseball jersey. Now, I don't remember the vendor that I did get this from, but I'll take a look at my bank statement and I'll try to see if they have, like, their names up there. If I can remember the prices on everything and kind of match it up with stuff. But, yeah, I don't remember this. But this is just a simple jersey. You can get this from pretty much any vendor. But yeah, this is what I got. I got it in a size large. It fits well, but I'm probably just going to wear it with like it open with like a white t-shirt underneath. Ooh, ooh, ooh. So yeah, I always wanted a jersey. So yeah, this is what I got. I paid $45 for it. That was the cheapest I saw at the trade show. Um, They were running for like, somebody said 75 And I was just like, ooh. All right, cool. I'm gonna come back and I ain't never went back. So yeah, this is <laughs> this is the uh, jersey and I got it for forty five dollars. So the next item is this cute little tumbler. I think this is my favorite out of all my purchases. This one actually came from Oh So Crafty. Uh, so yeah, this is what it looks like, and they also featured a thank you card. 
and this is their information yes so this ran me about $35 love how slender it is and I actually ordered another one so I can't wait it, it looks just like exactly like this um, as far as the structure of it but it is in the color cream and I have like some gold glitter going down the side so I cannot wait to get that I love tumblers this was a must-have so yeah oh so crafty thank you so much okay so my next purchase were um, some scarves so pretty much with the scarves you can wear it um, any kind of way you want to it's very versatile you can wear it around your neck um, tie it like you can let it hang long or you can tie it into a bow I did get a few tutorials haven't mastered it yet but I'm trying so you can either wear it like that or I've seen a lot of people wear them on their purses um, yeah I think that's pretty much the only two ways I saw for people to wear it. and of course you can wear it in your hair but these are going to either go around my neck or on my purses so this was from for educators only that was the name of the business so if you like these and they had different styles so if you really are into scarves are looking to try try them out try for educators only they have them one for twenty dollars and then two for thirty five you can't beat that and these are pretty pretty long so definitely go check them out all right so for the next i don't oh ooh, this is a bomber jacket details details oh this looks so good and it looks even better on so yes this was from a vendor i don't remember the name but like i said i'm gonna check my bank statements and leave their information in the comment section i end up spending 60 something dollars with this vendor because i did add on another scarf this one is super cute so i think um yeah i pay like 60 something this was originally $60 itself or 65 but he was letting me go for 45 because he said that he had a few left over from the last convention so they had to mark them down but yes oh I love it so this is definitely probably going to be my go-to jacket now I've been wanting these for a very very long time so like I said I'll leave the vendor's name and information in the description box down below next is this cute little bucket hat don't remember the vendor's name but um, originally I think some people some vendors were selling this for like $30 um, this was the last one that this vendor had if they were going to sell it for me for 15 but I did talk them down to 12 that's what you gotta do so yes super cute love this it's kind of like a mesh jersey type of feel to it and yes this is perfect to wear during the summertime or pretty much you can wear it anytime you want to wear it so yeah love this okay so this next vendor this was actually the first vendor i purchased from just because they were having a great sale um they had all t-shirts for ten dollars and then i think they lowered it on the last day to five dollars so this one says girl by myra davis hammond i love this okay love 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 this and i did get mine in a size large so this is when you're just like running errands you can dress it up dress it down maybe throw on some skinny jeans so we still say skinny jeans or wear skinny jeans i don't know what it's called now just throw some jeans on some straight leg jeans with some heels and call it a day you could throw like a blazer with this like I said, it's very, you know, versatile. You can dress it up and dress it down. So this is one of the shirts I paid for, which was $10. And like I said, that was my first purchase. The second one, I ended up getting three, but I wore the third one on my way back home. So I have to wash it, but I believe it said the real thing. Um, if I'm not mistaken, I don't know. But it was kind of like the Coca-Cola theme. That was the, what the shirt looked like so just to give you like a visual this one says born pretty but pledge delta okay love this one um got this one in a size large as well they had a, a big variety of um shirts but these are the only three that really stuck out to me they had an america's next top model i think it was america's best sorority um 
but like I said, I don't remember. But what I'll do is like I'll look at my bank statements to kind of compare the prices with the item and then I'll leave it in the description box down below. Next, I have um, some slippers. So my line sister actually told me about this. Shout out to my live five. Um, she came and got me. I didn't open these. But it comes with, like, with a little carrying pouch. And these are perfect like, if you have heels and you're not trying to wear your heels all day. Have these in your purse. So yes, these are what it looks like. Paid $13 for this. Got mine in a size medium. Um, and she said that they are super comfortable. They actually feel good on the inside. And also the bottom of these looks like it's very supportive. But like I said, they're slippers. So not to wear all the time, but like if you have heels on and you don't want to keep your heels on all day, pack these in your purse. They're just great. So like I said, I paid $13 for that. Don't remember the vendor, but um, yeah, great price. I think you can pretty much probably find these anywhere. Alrighty, so the next purchase is from Gratia Pearls. I hope I pronounced that right. Comes in this cute little pouch. Love that. They had a, a huge station set up to where they had different types of charms. So I'm going to show you the charms that I end up getting. So their charms range from about $5 to $5 um, item order the spacers. And then their charms were like $10, $15, and $20. So I end up getting this charm. Let's see. How do I put a focus for y'all? There we go. Not really. Okay, kind of, sort of. It just don't want to focus for y'all. But let me see if I can do this like one at a time. There we be all day. Listen. Just focus, please. Alright. Y'all kind of get the picture. It's the 42 with the letters. Um, this is, I don't know how them people, <laughs> these people on YouTube be doing this. Okay. I don't know y'all. Okay. I guess y'all could kind of see that a little bit. Okay. This is a spacer I got. It's silver and red. Um, this is a charm. It has our letters on it. Established in 1913. That's what that side says. Okay. And then on the back. It says made in 2020. That was the year across. Okay. Next. I have the Oop charm. I actually got this from a different vendor. But I just put it in the bag. Y'all this. I'm a hot mess trying to. <laughs> trying to get for this to focus it's not working this this hand which i'll be doing that that's not working for me so leave a some suggestions please this is the mid i think this is my favorite one okay it's just not gonna focus i'm about to stop doing it i look crazy okay that's the mid these are two other spacers i end up getting they're silver and red. And then lastly, this one is just the pyramid. I said I was going to stop doing it. Okay. Yeah, so those are all the charms that I um, got. Definitely, I believe that's probably over $100. So we're the bulk of my spending came from but i really wanted to make me a delta bracelet so what i'll probably do is order me like a the round pandora bracelet and then just add those i may need a few spacers but i believe i know the place to go and get you know a space a pack of spacers okay so next we have some items from my greek boutique and i love that they put it in a little reusable bag great promo um, so I think I bought like three, three items from them. 
Um, they were all five dollars. So, um, or this may have been more. I don't know. But I got their little coffee mug. Then it says this diva needs her coffee. So this is cute. And it has like a little stirring spoon to go with it. And you just put it on the side when you're finished. How cute is that? Super cute. So this came from My Greek Boutique if you're interested in purchasing. Next, I bought this little pocket socket from them. And this is great to just go like on the back of your phone. Oh, I got it to focus. Okay, so maybe the hand trick do, does work. It just don't work in the charms. But yes, so I got this. This was $5. I thought this was super cute to just put on the back of my phone and help me hold my phone. So, yes, my Greek boutique. Y'all was on it. Um, and then lastly, the last item I got from them was this um, watch band. And it says Delta Girl. Um, and it has since 1913. So this is super cute. And this was $5 as well. So yes, definitely check them out. Um, I believe they may have some sales going on. So y'all better jump on it. So that is My Greek Boutique. Alrighty, so the next item I'm showing you is kind of like a... Um, it's a jacket, but it's like a long jacket. It's not like a long jacket. Actually, I'm going to go ahead and open it up for y'all. Now, I paid $30. The reason why I paid $30 is because it has a defect on it. So the red that's from the jacket is bleeding in on the white. Which I really don't care because I don't care. But yeah, you can see the little bleeding. But you can't beat this for $30. Come on now. Look at the back. Fire. Super cute. Like, you you can't pass up on that. Look at the details. Like, details. 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 So, if, if it's super cute, I end up getting it in the size medium. It fits great in the medium. This is what it looks like on the inside. It's kind of like that mesh material. This is perfect um, if it's raining outside. Well, I said the back. I don't know because it's white. Then you might have a little bit more of the um, red running over to the white. But kind of weird when it's dry. Okay, so this is perfect. Like if you have like a Delta event to go to or if you just want to like um, a probate um, or any function that's related to Delta. Or if you just, you know, out and about running, running errands, you could wear it. I shouldn't be the one to tell you where to wear it to. But yes, this is just perfect. It comes with the buttons if you need to replace buttons but yeah don't remember the vendor like i said i'm gonna take a look at my bank statement and i'm gonna leave all the vendors information if i can find it i already know that i paid 30 dollars for this so it wasn't nothing but 31 dollars because they had to charge a uh running fee for my card so yeah i should be able to find this vendor with no problem Alrighty, so this next item is the little sleeping band that you can put over your eyes. This says Diva Sleeping. I don't remember the vendor that I got it from, but I paid $5. It was a vendor who had pretty much everything on their table for $5. Um, but this was super cute. I don't really wear this, but I probably wear it like if I'm on vacation or somewhere where they don't have curtains. And I don't want the room to be too, too bright. So, yes. You never go wrong with an item that's five dollars okay so this last item i'm going to show you is actually my biggest purchase and everything that you're going to see in this all together was a hundred dollars so that was a pretty good deal this is actually from zoo or zotic couture and they had an amazing deal on this so let me go ahead and open it and i'll show you guys what everything is included Alrighty, so this is what the sweater looks like and this actually says um it's from a different vendor so i don't know but um this is what the sweat sweat shirt looks like I'm not really a big fan of white but just because if I do wear makeup, it's easy for it to get on the clothing item. But I'm going to try to keep this clean as possible. So, yeah, super cute. I got mine in a size medium and it fits really well. I end up trying it on in person and I had a shirt on under it. So, that should say a lot that it 
fits pretty good even with um, a clothing item underneath. Alrighty, so here are the accessories. It comes like with a little clip, I guess with the business name on there. Um, I'm not sure what the business is actually called because I'm seeing um, different names. But I'll leave all that information in the description box down below. So this is a lanyard. Okay, so it's a pearl lanyard. This was pretty unique and cool. Um, yeah, they really did that. And you can just hook up either your keys or like your um, work badge. So yes, this is the pearl lanyard. It also included a little pin that matches the sweatshirt. There we go. And also a 1913 bracelet. I probably will wear it with the bracelet that I have on now it complements it really good so yeah that's probably what I'll pair it with but I still have a few more items to go so next I have this cute little velvet pouch and it houses this um, fanny pack now I'm not a big fan of gold but when I saw this I was like oh this is cute So this is what the fanny pack looks like. Okay, and this is just the style on the back. Now I do believe that it does have the straps on the inside of the purse. I'm not gonna go ahead and open it, but it did come with straps. And I do see like a lot of people wearing the fanny pack like this nowadays instead of around the waist. So I think this is how I will rock my fanny pack. Um, I'll post pictures on my Instagram account once I do, you know, wear this. So make sure that you're following me so that you can see how I rocked it. Okay, so the last item are pajamas. And it's a set, actually. So it does come with um, the eye cover and the head wrap. So that's cute. And also, the top. And like I said, everything is pretty much long on me. So, I'm not, you know, too, too worried. This is perfect if I'm traveling out of town. Or if I may do like a pajama Christmas party or any pajama party. I think these are super cool. Super cool. Super cool and appropriate to wear, um, you know to an outing to where it is pajama related now this is the bottom and they are super long but i don't know everything is long on me so yeah this is the item that is the package that came with it so like i said everything that i showed you was a hundred dollars um, that was included so I thought that was like a pretty amazing deal that's the only reason why I end up buying it all right well that was everything that I purchased from the trade show and um, my experience at our 55th national convention I hope y'all enjoyed this video and kind of give you a little insight on what my experience was like um, be sure to like, comment, and give this video a thumbs up. Don't forget to hit that notification bell so that you don't many, miss any new uploads from me. And all that good stuff. Comment down below of what item is your favorite and you would like to see me wear and take pictures and post on social media. Alright, well thank you so much for watching this video and I'll catch you in the next one. Bye!